Today, even more than ever before, bridge owners, engineers and everybody involved in bridge installation and repair works face a lot of potential and actual dangers. Not only does the work success depend on calculations precision, but also on various external factors. A single wrong decision may lead to disastrous consequences and result in bridges moving apart, cracking and falling. Only in the United States, out of 6,513 bridges surveyed, 23% are considered to be structurally deficient or functionally obsolete. Unfortunately, there is countless number of problems that can occur during bridge launching, maintenance and repair works. Material deformations and change of internal structure can be caused by accidents during launching process, material fatigue, thermal effects, heavy traffic, preliminary and real-time values mismatch. Deformations of various kinds are caused by material tense deformed state and internal mechanical stress that builds up on the construction parts. During the launching process, especially of bridges with long superstructures, the construction may bend under its own weight when the excessive internal stress accumulates in a certain bridge section. In case bending goes beyond acceptable level, the bridge may fail to reach the final destination. During the installation, internal structure change can cause twisting deformation of a certain area. Such a change is often connected with weather conditions and thermal effects in particular. Under the influence of sun rays, non-uniform heating of the upper layers of metal occurs. The farther the construction is pushed by the jacks, the more the bridge swings, and again the chances of its reaching the final destination dramatically decrease. One of other common reasons for bridge banding is overloading by heavy traffic. In this case, the fatigue builds up on the construction parts, and as a result, the microcracks appear. Here suffers the bridge reliability and performance of structural components, and the bridge wears out faster than it's supposed to. Thus, material internal change can be caused by various external factors, and it's impossible to take them all into consideration. It puts additional challenge to contemporary bridge monitoring systems. Despite high level of development of bridge health diagnostics methods recognized by today's science, there are still substantial drawbacks that don't allow to fully rely on any of them. Strain gauge transducers of various types don't give the opportunity to provide online monitoring of changes in bridge sections during the launching process. Ultrasonic, electromagnetic and eddy current crack detectors help to reveal only the already existing cracks when it's more important to detect the pre-destruction state. Optical and laser methods influenced by surrounding conditions can't suggest data reliable enough to give the precise estimation. It's evident a completely new approach to monitoring is necessary, a system that would allow to give full-scale analysis of bridge state and foresee the problems. This new approach was embodied in our Internal Stress Analyzer, the original bridge monitoring method that allows to control internal mechanical stress which occurs in ferromagnetic metals under the influence of various factors. Internal Stress Analyzer is a combination of already existing and the innovative technologies developed by our specialists. The system is introduced by original sensor units which provide high reliability and dynamics of data collection. Internal Stress Analyzer suggests continuous online monitoring, instant notification about potential construction dangers, fully automatic control via redundant wireless link, maintenance-free, user-friendly, fault-tolerant system. The system comprises two components, linear displacement transducer and ferromagnetic stress sensor. Linear displacement transducer serves as the means of estimating motion, thickness, surface roughness, object expansion and compression. Ferromagnetic stress sensor, the major component, introduces unique technology of magnetic permeability measurement. It suggests internal mechanical stress detection, mechanical vibrations detection, with measurement interval 0.1 seconds. The developed measurement system presupposes two identical transducers, operating and compensating. Transducers are fixed on the surface under test by contact sealing. Compensating transducer is placed on the unloaded metal sample made of the same material as the construction under test. The value difference is transmitted to the main unit, processed and sent to the operator. The sensor working principle is displayed in the following video. The metal part of the construction, due to various factors influence, undergoes certain kinds of deformation. The ferromagnetic sensor signalizes about the internal tense deformed state of the metal. The signal is transmitted to the personal computer and displayed in the form of a graph. In the situation when the deformation level is beyond the acceptable rates, the system informs about the upcoming danger. 
In this case, the work should be stopped immediately, which allows the material to gradually restore its initial structure. Let's see the technology in use. Vitebsk Southwest Bypass Bridge across Western Dvina River. Distance between piers 126 meters. Number of electronic units 42. Sampling rate 1 second. Number of values received several thousands. Vitebsk Bypass Bridge across Western Dvina River was successfully launched, no excessive mechanical stress release observed. The innovative method was applied during Neumann Bridge reconstruction and also to monitor stress release in ferromagnetic metals during various upgrade and repair works. Internal Stress Analyzer provides all-stage monitoring and helps engineers to estimate the structural condition of the construction and formulate timely corrective strategies. Internal Stress Analyzer – a perfect market solution. Crack prevention during bridge launching. Bridge inspections cost reduction. Long-term application, serviceability. Enhanced accuracy and data precision.